Hello, this is Death Rider, and welcome back to Tower of Courage. So, I'm thinking I'm going to start this episode right off with the tower, and then I'll do the other exploration, all of the other exploration I need to do. <laughs> and in fact, there's actually something I forgot to do <coughs> after level 2 that I, I could have done because I have the bracelet. I didn't actually check out what it was uh, between last episode and this episode, but I just went on the map and I noticed, oh, there's a, uh, a block I can push. And I do remember it being something, and it's actually in the direction of where that knight told me level four is. Remember he said it's in a forest near the Forest of Illusion. This block I'm thinking of is in that direction. Alright, I don't know if that's... Is that really how he intended that to happen? Okay, interesting. And we are outside of the tower. I love the animation on the side there. Looks really cool. Okay, I unlocked that. That's good. Clear out a little bit of these enemies. Yeah, they did a really good job with uh, this quest. The two guys that worked on this. I don't know if there was more than two. I just know of the V2. I'm actually going to clear all these out. Well, thank you. I don't think I want to go over there yet. Ah, heck, I will. I can. Well, alright, I can't go that way. Didn't give me an indication that 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 did anything, but we'll have to see. Maybe it'll maybe it allowed me to take the outside path now. No. Hmm. Maybe it unlocked something over here. Oh wait, I never did go this way, did I? Maybe it was. Maybe that's what that did. It unlocked this. Okay, is that all that gave me? Just one measly heart? Alright. Proceed. Is there nothing here? Apparently... Blue Hawk to Rock. Totally... Totally pointless. Now this one is a little bit annoying, I'm just gonna say that now. Well, maybe not. Okay, I just hit another switch. With no indication of what it does. 
Also, it shows that I can apparently go down here. Even though I can't. Oh, don't you dare. This way. Ah, okay, that's what that did. And unlock this. Jeez. I don't like the situation, but I am killing them. Whoa, I didn't want to hook shots of that. Nice. What is my prize? I think I know what it is. I might be wrong. No, I wasn't wrong. Haha. <laughs> Upgraded armor. Nice. Tower of Floors 4. I already, I already know what floor this is. Yeah. Alright, so that kind of tells you what the next item is, like the next item you'll be getting. At least it's quicker to the fourth floor than the others. So on for some hookshot exploration, as well as pushing this one block. That I can think of. But first, let me just check my pictures here. I might have. Is there something that's hookshot related? Okay, I don't see anything hookshot related. So. Ah, there's that. I'll head off there right now. And in the process, I can check that cave there. I don't remember if that cave had anything. And also, in that process, I can get a potion. And also, I forgot to get this. I just now realized that I forgot to get this. Like, as I was talking about things, I forgot to... Oh! Uh, that, I didn't mean to do that, but it worked out. <laughs> Alright, sure. Why not? I can get a potion here. Oh, wow, I didn't get hit from that. And these are these are hookshot spots, just so you know. Like I said, if it looks like you can hookshot to it, hookshot to it. I think I said that in the last episode. Yeah, and I accidentally used the potion, which was stupid. So let's... I want to actually check out the uh, thing I forgot right now, because I can. Right here. Yes, this is the way to level 4, I believe. So it actually, it was fine that I forgot to do it before, because I couldn't do anything with it anyway. And I just want to quickly check here. There's one of these caves that I think you needed the hookshot for. Yes, it is indeed this cave. Might as well grab that since I have the extended wallet. Hey, another heart container. Nice. Jeez, I almost got stuck again. Getting things done in a short amount of time. I love it. Yeah, that's where I'm trying to go. 
That'd have been cool if I could hook shot right to it from here. So the way you get there is by taking that path to the right. And I have the hook shot, so... Whatever. <laughs> Big whoop. Another heart piece. Thank you very much. Hold on a minute. Alright, I don't know I don't know why I even thought I wanted to do that. I would just end up stuck. Wait, wait, wait. This little shortcut right here. Though that might not have been that much of a shortcut. <laughs> so I'm trying to think if there even is anything else to do. Except, of course, what the game wants me to do. It wants me to go in there. Hmm. Okay, I can't do anything there. I know that. Yeah, I think that's all I can do at the moment. That just goes to the Force of Illusion, by the way. Level four. Okay, I actually shouldn't have done that. Walk into these shots, shall we? So now I'm up here. So there's actually a thing right here. If you can make out what it is, you need the hammer to get it though. Whoa! Rapid fire. Yeah, we'll be seeing a lot more of that rapid fire later on. Also, that bush over there is very important. But that's late game stuff right there. So I don't think there's anything else I can do here, no. So there's actually a thing here, but need the hammer for it. Also notice the uh, logos here. Pretty cool. Freaky Fish Production. Ah, level four. Remember in episode one I mentioned that there was a dungeon that's a big portal maze? Welcome to the portal maze dungeon. Very easy to get lost here. Just simply with everything you can do. <laughs> Yeah, I see no reason not to start. I'm pretty well geared up. I can handle this. <clears throat> OK, 
Okay, key. That, that's... Oh, okay. That's actually probably why they give you the compass so early. Just because there's so many rooms here. Just, just the sheer number of rooms in this dungeon is pretty big. Or pretty high. Just kind of want to... Oh yeah, okay, that's right, I forgot about that weird little glitch. There's apparently no map for these two two rooms here, so like this room, yeah, there's no map. Anyway, it's not a big deal. Make a note of that. Oh, also, make a note of these numbers here. Very, very, very important. You need to pay attention to those in order to get through. Also, pay attention to what's in these rooms. So, in room one, there's a like, like... Just, you need to be observant for this quest. Or, er, well, yeah, for this quest, but for this dungeon. I'm trying to think. I think, is there a bomb spot here? I do remember a room like this having a bomb spot. I think this is the room with the bomb spot. Maybe not. It might have been in room three. Well, there is something here. This this is a thing. I just don't remember if I can do anything with it yet. No, I don't think I can. So you get that key, and now you use the key. Yeah, and there's the boss room. <laughs> Oh, I turned around too early. That land mole wanted out. Okay, so here we go. It, enter the maze. Not really sure what these are about, but whatever. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, there's a lot of switches. A lot of them like that. Okay, I was gonna say, I don't remember how to deal with those. Also, good choice on music on them. Forest theme from Ocarina of Time. Not bad, not bad. First exposure to Dwyer's. Okay, I think this is all that's here. So you gotta really try to remember where these portals take you. Eventually you'll just know, just because how of how often you go through them. This dungeon was actually really well made. <laughs> Except I think there was one part where it's kind of like, like, what? Yay, it's a flower! So actually, I'm gonna... Alright, I'm apparently not on the map. Uh, hold on a minute. Aha! Bomb spots. Okay. I knew that that was a thing. I mean, it was clearly a thing. It was too obvious to not be a thing. So I'm actually going to check up here before I end things. All right, yeah, I'm gonna end things here. Uh, next episode, I'll be coming through level four. I will not be beating it in the next episode or possibly even the one after that. I'm, I might be over-exaggerating how complicated this place is or convoluted would actually be a better way to say it. It is very much so, but hopefully my memory will help me through and I won't get lost. <laughs> because getting lost is very possible. So until then, this has been Death Rider, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.